Hey folks, Sam here with Sam Wood Outdoors. Actually, it's Sam Wood Indoors today. I'm in the shop. You guys haven't seen my shop here. I'll show you my shop real quick. Here's my shop. Yeah, it's a disaster. But anyways, so a lot of you guys, like me, are either, you know, working inside or have a shop or whatever. And, you know, come lunchtime or break time, we're warming up yesterday's spaghetti. Well, today, hopefully we're going to change that. But I don't know, because I've seen this once on a video, and I thought, I'm going to try that. We're stepping up a little bit. But, uh, you know, you guys are at work. You got a bike your wave. That's kind of it. You got a short break. How about if we had some steaks for our break? Now, here's the best part about it. We're going to cook them in a toaster. I don't know. So we're going to see. But. If this works, you can go like the Family Dollar, get a $15 toaster, keep it in your locker at work, stop on your way at a quick trip or whatever, get them little nice little steaks, badass, you know, keep some seasoning stuff. We're going to make a steak sandwich is what I'm going to try. So here we go. We got these little, uh, I actually bought some cheap ass steaks. I know, I know, I wimped out because um, I didn't know if it was going to work. So I got some round eye chuck steak and we're going to try it. So anyways, got our seasoning, got some Montre or uh, some roasted garlic and herb. Now this goes good on chicken, but I also like it on my steak. Oh, look at that shit. Don't you just hate this like, you know, they got to make like steak seasoning childproof or something. So anyways, so how badass is this going to be if this works? I heard, uh, you know, they did it like four rounds and it made it medium rare. Uh, and, and damn, when I see shit like that, I just got to try it. So we'll put some seasoning on there. Pack it in. Just like that. All right. So we got it set on high. Let's do two. Come on, we got to. You know, and you know, like the worst thing is probably going to happen is uh, it's going to get a little greasy. And we're going to start a fire. Yeah, if this works, you know, maybe we'll try chicken breast, stuff like that. But to make it interesting, I put this cardboard down. Because, you know, like, if, if we're going to start a fire, let, let's do it badass and, and really start a fire. So we're going to stick that down in our toaster. And uh, we're going to got her going. Pretty crazy. You guys want to see? I know you want to see, don't you? You guys want to see it? Okay, hang on. Here it is. I don't know, guys. Steak in a toaster. But it's a game changer. It really is. You know, now you guys can take, like, steaks, little round steaks. You cut out your venison tenderloin, your egg te uh, elk tenderloin. You can take it to work. And, uh, and uh, you could uh, rock it up. Could be badass. So, I don't know if we should... Uh, We'll probably let this whole thing run. This would be like a long video. So, uh, but I'll probably edit it and then shorten it up a little bit because y'all, everybody knows, everybody got a short attention span, including me. And then, uh, you know, we'll come back, we'll check on the whole thing, but I'll keep the full length video in case there's any doubters out there that think that I'm full of shit. So, all right, we will be back. All right, check it out. We just went through the first round. It popped up, but it doesn't. The steaks are heavier than bread, so it kind of keeps it down. So we got to pop it up. Oh, you got to wait till you see this. Yeah, my K-Bar spork. It's a spoon and a fork, but it's also got a knife in it. It's badass. Let's check it out. Oh, oh, look at that. They are coming along nicely. We need another round or two or three. We'll see. Put that in there. Ah, it looks like this shit's going to work. And that's badass. I don't know. Pretty freaking cool. All right. We'll give her another round and we'll be back. All right. Another peek. Oh, you can hear him popping and sizzling. A little bit of smoke. It's coming along. They're smelling freaking awesome. I'll give them that. Now I'm kind of, I'm kind of regretting buying the cheap steaks. I think this would have been uh, 
freaking awesome. Like, can you imagine going to work and like making filet mignon in a, in a freaking toaster at, at lunch? You would be like the envy of the whole shop. Oh, damn, it smells good. Can't believe we haven't thought of this sooner. Huh. Just waiting for it to pop again. Oh, I can't wait. Let's take a look at them. It's, oh, there it is. See, it popped, but it's too heavy, like I said, so, to raise it up. All right. Now, now things are looking pretty awesome. Look at that shit. It is, man, man, I can't even believe it. Oh, this one's looking really good. This one's getting a little char on the fat. You can see we're getting a little char. Uh, I think one more time. One more time, I think, and we're going to be, uh, we're going to have it. I got, uh, I bought some rolls, so we're going to have that, put some butter on it, a little steak sandwich, got our little shop plate, little piece of cardboard, doesn't get any better than that. So we'll be back. It's just a little bit. We're so close to freaking having toaster steaks. I, I just don't know what to say. All right, guys, here it is. This is a, it's in for its third time. Um, the video that I watched, two guys did it. They said they wanted four times for medium rare. Uh, it's actually cooking up, cooking up pretty nice. So I'm going to get ready. I think I'm going to try, I'm going to try one at three rounds and then we'll we'll put the last one in there for four and we'll see where it comes out but uh you know steak sandwich got myself some of these little uh butter oh they're just popped so we're ready i gotta hurry up get this roll here we got some butter 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 should have put that by the oh it's a, it's pretty soft we'll be all right Oh, that's a lot of butter. We probably don't need that much butter. Of course, I don't know. Is there ever such thing as too much butter? All right, so here we go. Third round. This is three rounds. It's pretty nice. Let's uh, let's uh, cut her once here and see what it looks like. Oh, that's going to be perfect. That is going to be perfect. So you can see, it's actually a little bit too much done for me. I probably should have stopped at two, but it is a, holy shit balls, that's good. Oh my gosh. And then, oh, are you kidding me? Oh, oh. Oh yeah, this is like kick the lunch lady in the nuts good. And you all know that lady, that lunch lady, she had them hairs, she, she had some nuts. But this is it guys, I'm telling you, you gotta try it, you gotta take a toaster to work, you gotta make steak. Oh, oh. <laughs> that shit is unbelievable. It, it worked. All right, guys, I think for alligator hunting uh, tonight, me and my boy are going. So to hopefully this video tides you over for a little bit. But definitely, definitely toaster steak. Ah, this is the way to go. Even this cheap-ass steak. I got three of them for like... Uh, Three of them for five bucks. Hell yeah!